Um, I'm not fired. I'm gonna be at this dealership for a long time. Well, unfortunately, that didn't take very long. Sad to report that uh, today is my official last day here at Bachman Chevrolet. Before I leave the company though, uh, I do have one more delivery that they're allowing me to do here at the dealership and that's actually to a YouTube subscriber, which I'm really excited about. So I wanna show you this vehicle uh, and maybe introduce you to this uh, person who's buying the vehicle. I really don't put customers on my YouTube channel much just for the simple fact that I just, I'm never very comfortable with it. And also before you make judgment or form an opinion, you need to watch the entire video because we're gonna go into detail of what has transpired. And this right here is my last new Chevrolet that I'm going to be delivering, hopefully just for a while because obviously we wanna open up our own franchise Chevy store. So. This thing is monumental for a couple different reasons. One, these folks come from Illinois uh, to get this vehicle from me strictly because of this channel. Uh, but also this was with all the microchip processor stuff going on. This was like forever getting here. We ordered a 21 and we ordered a 22, I think on this particular vehicle. Um, it's just absolutely crazy. But this is the brand new 2022 Chevrolet Traverse in the Redline edition. So pretty awesome vehicle. They're over there doing their paperwork right now but uh so i need to tell them as well are you sure you want it <laughs> yeah you don't look excited you don't look excited enough so this is uh this is a really monumental delivery for me this is my last new chevrolet i'm delivering really tomorrow's my last day i knew it i thought you were staying thought so too <laughs> so we'll have a video up on wednesday uh this is gonna be part of the video on wednesday and um I'm a little emotional about it, I'll tell you. I'm, I'm, I'm really, really emotional about it. So, but, uh, but yeah, I'm, I'm excited. That this finally came in. <laughs> oh. See you, buddy. Yeah. Well, let's start off by saying if you need a used car, contact me now. I don't sell any more new Chevys, unfortunately, until we own Davenport Chevrolet. If you've got a car to sell, hit me up. As long as you can get it to Southern Indiana by Louisville, Kentucky, not an issue. We can purchase it directly from you for cash. And just like I said at the beginning of the video, unfortunately, today is my last day after 11 and a half years. May I say, they're wonderful 11 and a half years at Bachman Chevrolet. We've completely it's cut ties amicably. There's nothing negative to say here. There's nothing that you should do to bring negative light to them. The Bachmans are absolutely wonderful family. Ryan Bachman, Steve Bachman, Teresa Bachman, I absolutely love to death. But just like any business out there, the car business is very brutal. And if they think that there's any type of conflict of interest, they've got to act on it and do what's best for their company. The great thing about this is they have nothing but high hopes and high support for me to be successful just like in my last video when I told you I bought this place and we started this place, every single comment that was ever put on there was nothing but positivity. They have the same sentiment as you do. But most of me leaving is pretty much on me. I went in knowing that, hey, if they don't like the idea of me owning this place and working there, that we have to split. And to be honest with you, one of my great friends, Troy, we had lunch one day and he said it to me this way exactly. How can you possibly be successful if you're not 100% all in? And that resonated with me highly. You can't be successful at anything by doing 10, 15, 20, 30%. And with me, I have so many companies and so many things going on that I do have to focus on several things. And adding Corvette sales, new car sales, Bachman Chevrolet into the mix, one of them is gonna suffer. And you know what would suffer? this place right here, because that's what I know and that's my safety net there at Bachman Chevrolet. And the day after we spoke and I let them know, uh, Ryan Bachman came to me and sat down with the general sales manager of the company. And he just basically said, hey, I don't know how we can make this work. We had a great conversation, very positive, very upbeat, nothing negative after all. I worked there for 11 and a half years and these people are family to me. We left that meeting and was like, let's just think about it a little bit more. Thanksgiving was coming up. So we've got to talk again on Friday, right after Thanksgiving. And at that point, the general sales manager pretty much said, are you gonna quit or do we gotta fire you? And I said, I don't know. I need to talk to my wife about this. This is something obviously I brought up on myself, 
but I don't know what to do. But of course, everything in my life is always great news. So the more great news is, is now I'm gonna still be creating the content that I've done ever since you saw this YouTube channel for the first time. We're still gonna talk about how to buy cars properly. We're gonna talk about the scams. I'm creating a brand new system so that way you can basically take me with you to every car dealership in the country over at autocarbuying101.com. And if you haven't visited that website yet, you're missing out because you can save thousands of dollars with my new system. And this is stuff that I do not share publicly on YouTube. And the really awesome thing about this is I can get more in depth and I don't have any little birdie sitting on my shoulder said is somebody at Bachman Chevrolet gonna have a problem with if I say this so now I can be a little bit more uncensored on this channel and get into more depth and details about certain things that I've never talked about before because I was worried about my job at Chevrolet and just to reiterate I only sell used cars now I do not have a new car franchise as of yet when that happens I will let you know and because this was not part of our financial plan if there's any help that you can provide to us and that's only asking you to follow Chevy Dude YouTube channel Chevy Dude Facebook page and make sure you share those videos because I make money off of social media by viewing of videos so make sure you watch those videos watch them all the way through and then share them as well so now it's time for us to go buy our very first car so down in the comment section what do you think my very first car is going to be. And of course, don't forget to check out ChevyDudeStore.com and get your swag.